All right, I'm back. I haven't made a video in quite some time now, other than the Just Cause 2 videos. Those are just fillers when I'm not making normal videos. An update, my dad is in the hospital because he had been sick in bed since last Sunday. I've never seen him like he was. He could barely talk. He could barely stand for more than 10 seconds without losing his balance or throwing up. Just hope he's okay. Alright, this is going to be a different video. I'm going to look at news stories and give my opinion on what I think about them. I guess this, is, this can count as another rant video. Maybe. Yahoo News. Oh, this is all political shit. I don't care about that. There is a thing I want to give my opinion on, though. About a week ago, I believe it was on, t hold on, it should tell my Facebook because I posted something about it. Go down, damn you. On the 10th, Daniel Tosh, I'm sure you know who he is, crossed the line just a bit at one of his shows. There was this woman who posted the entire story on her website. She said her and her friend wanted to do something different, and they went to one of Daniel Tosh's shows. And he was going on and on. And saying stuff about how rape jokes are funny. Which sometimes I will admit I have laughed at rape jokes. This girl in the audience said, Excuse me, but rape jokes are never funny. Daniel said, Come on, come on guys, wouldn't it be funny if she was just like raped, like right now, by like five guys. Like, come on, you know it'd be funny. And this lady was like, oh my god, and just left and posted about it on her website. Well, if you know Daniel Tosh and have seen his stuff like I have, you know the next part is something he would never do. He later on Twitter apologized. He said, I believe he said, all out of context misquotes aside, I sincerely apologize. And apparently that wasn't good enough because everybody was fucking blasting him with hate all over Twitter. And it was pissing me off because, honestly, on my list... He's my number one favorite comedian of all time. And people were just like, his apology was bullshit, I don't believe him, he's just a horrible, horrible man. He is, this is not the first rape joke he has made, and it's probably not the second or third or fourth or fifth or sixth. But goddamn, first of all, comedians don't like to be heckled. So that was your first mistake. Just let him go on with his show. If that girl hadn't made that comment out loud, he probably would not have said it. I mean, he did cross the line a little bit, but it's not far from what type of humor he usually has. But Jesus. Sorry he wasn't on his knees going, I'm sorry, I'll do anything for you. He apologized. Get over yourselves. Stop taking shit so seriously. There's another thing. Uh, Sylvester Stallone's son Sage was found dead. I don't remember if it was an apartment or a hotel, but investigation was done, and they said he might be act might have actually been 
dead there for three to four days, possibly even a week. Dead. And I don't know about you guys, but I seriously hope I'm not the only one noticing a huge, extreme high rate of celebrity deaths this year so far. I mean, every celebrity just seems to be dying like every week. Every week it's a new one. Ernest Borgnine died. Andy Griffith died. One of the producers of Jaws died. Sylvester Stallone's son died. And many others. Uh... And I put on my YouTube channel that if you guys have any questions, make sure they're not rude, just nice, polite questions. I will try to answer as many as I can. I put a link to my Facebook page, my Twitter page, and my Google Plus page on my YouTube channel. I don't use Google Plus that much, so... Just to be safe, if you want your questions answered, probably go to Facebook or um, Twitter. And if you ask me a question, make sure you put in, um, I've seen your videos on YouTube, and then ask your question. Because if some just, just some random person posts on my Facebook or Twitter, I'm not going to know what the hell it's for. So make sure you put, I saw your videos on YouTube. And then ask your question. Just so I know what it is. If you have any questions. I will either answer them on Facebook or Twitter or probably make a Q&A video. It's going to be some news that's not about political shit. Go to Google News. God damn, more fucking political shit. <clears throat> Put some music on, it's too quiet in here. Yeah, usually when I'm at my dad's, I'm spending time with him, so I don't make, normally make videos there. I might at some point, but I usually don't. Wow, there's nothing not about polit politics in Yahoo and Google News. Scorpio, nails on my 
if my Facebook friends have any stories for me to give my opinion for. Put, I'm making a new video where I read something from the news and give my opinion, but every damn story has something to do with politics. Please suggest something interesting. Also, first person to comment, I will give a shout out to exclamation point exclamation point might not be an exciting shout out now we wait YouTube. Fuck, I have it clicked to stay signed in on YouTube, but every time I close YouTube, I have to sign in again. I was going to make a video playing the game Slender, 
but I will admit that game is too fucking scary to play, so I, I, I'm not doing that. Plus, I don't have the equipment to show you the game footage as I'm playing it, so... Because I've been going back and watching old videos of PewDiePie playing games, and it's in, made me want to play these games. I've played Al Oni, Amnesia, Slender, Ex Mortis 1 and 2, fucking creepy games. Uh. SCP Containment Breach I think that's it This is probably going to be my most boring video But I don't care, I do what I want I think I might play Aoni again, but like I said, you won't be able to see it, but I guess you can hear it. If you want to see what it's like, either watch PewDiePie play it or just download it yourself. Gotta find it because I have no fucking clue where I put it. Fuck, I guess I deleted it. Install it. <sighs> this computer gets on my damn nerves sometimes. Oh, fuck. going to start downloading anytime soon. You, you, you can go anytime. Well, nobody commented, so I guess nobody has any interesting stories to read. Surprising, because barely anything is interesting anymore. So. <sighs> this game's not fucking downloading, so I'll make another video where I play it when I get it working, so bye. Damn it. 19 minutes.